The actress has been part of the Coronation Street cast since 2014, though became a regular in 2016. Gemma is known for her loud personality. Questionable dress sense and wearing foundation way too dark for her skin tone. The actress previously confessed that she had a hand in creating Gemma, including her makeup choices. She told TV Times, I decided that she enjoys putting makeup on and watches YouTube tutorials on how to get the latest looks, but gets them a little bit wrong. And she tries to be fashionable but has to make do with what she can afford. It was my idea that Gemma would buy the smallest sized clothes she could physically wear. So she looks a bit chubby on screen. She even had bleached hair when she arrived on the soap. Though has been allowed to revert to her natural color to avoid too much damage. And that's not the only difference. As Dolly Rose walked the trick awards red carpet looking an entirely different person. The 30 year old slipped into a chic grey trouser suit. A far cry from Gemma's gaudy tracksuits and party clothes. Under the jacket, the redhead wore an embellished bodysuit. Featuring a multicolored floral pattern. She kept accessories to a minimum, wearing a delicate gold necklace and matching earrings. A patent black satchel and some high-heeled ankle boots. The soap star attended the awards with Connor McIntyre, who plays the villainous Pat Fallon. He also looked different to his on-screen persona, wearing a deep burgundy suit, open-collared pink shirt, and thick-rimmed glasses. Unfortunately for the duo, Neither of them took to the stage to receive any awards in the categories they were nominated. Connor was nominated for Best Soap Actor. Losing out to Ryan Hawley, and Corey as a whole was beaten by Emma Dale for Soap of the Year. Both stars are sharing the spotlight on Corey at the moment though. As Felon continues his evil plans and Gemma deals with sleeping with Tyrone Dobbs, Alan Halsall. Coronation Street airs Mondays, Wednesdays and Fridays on ITV.